guys and welcome back for this video. So this one's actually a follow-up to the last one which was a tiny home speed build. This sim lives in that home and you will learn why in this video but I still urge you guys to check out that video because there's talk about a little Sims 3 let's play that may or may not be turning up on my channel sometime soon. Now Onto this video and Jocelyn's story. It is a bit of a sad one, guys, so I want to throw up a trigger warning for people who have experienced emotional and psychological or mental abuse, specifically by family members. So, Jocelyn's parents met straight out of high school. It was a whirlwind romance and they quickly fell pregnant. Her mother's parents, so Jocelyn's maternal grandparents, forced them to marry. They weren't a well-to-do family, but this was about 16 or 17 years ago, so it was a bit more of a traditional time and definitely a more of a traditional family. Um, the community was also very tight-knit, so word would have traveled fast and they didn't want their child, but even more than that, themselves to be judged for her indiscretion. Unfortunately, the stress and the quickness of a shotgun wedding forced the lovebirds apart and by the time little Jocelyn was born, it was clear that the relationship was just fizzled out. Um, Jocelyn's mother resented her daughter for this fact. In her eyes, her daughter had ruined her life and her relationship. Though her husband was stepping out and gambling and partying as a young, unattached man would, she still loved him and wanted him to love her as he once had. So growing up was really hard on Jocelyn because of this. Her father was completely emotionally and physically amused, uh, removed, not amu amused. He was rarely at home, so they had a non-relationship. Her mother, however, was there and she took out her pain on her daughter. This obviously had an effect on Jocelyn and growing up, she decided that she would never be that way to her children. She wanted everything that her mother had wanted that she'd never had. A stable home, children to love, and a kind husband who was there for her and her kids. But she knew this wasn't something that she'd get if she stayed. So as soon as she was able to, she started doing odd jobs here and there. And she was determined to get out, you guys. She worked hard and she earned the necessary amount of money with a little help from her future landlord. They made an arrangement and he built her a small home that would cost the amount that they'd both been able to save and pull together. She moved out as soon as she could and now they and now she lives in the home that I shared in the last video. But the past has still had an effect on Jocelyn. She doesn't want her f she doesn't have any friends though she wants them. It's a strong angry jealousy that keeps her from making friends as well as the whispers of her mother's words in her head filling her with a feeling of sadness and being completely inadequate. As much as she wants that future for herself, it's hard for her because she's scared she'll never have it. The last thing she wants is to become her mother. But she can't help but dream of waking up on a Christmas day with two or three beautiful children and a sweet husband. She wants it so badly. But will she allow herself to have it or will her trauma prevent her from having the thing she wants more than anything in this world? So that is her story and I'm leaving it up to you guys to let me know whether you guys think that or if you guys play with her because she will be up on the gallery if she gets her dream um so yeah she does have some cc and that will be linked um in the description below um i've already told you she's going to be up the gallery the video is up in the gallery as well and um yeah that's about it so we actually have more time for the voiceover than i thought we would so I thought I would just mention once again the Sims 3 Let's Play. It's actually going to be a Bella Goth and um, Mortimer Goth one um, going from when they were children and living through the, what we know is their life, actually. And um, I want to give them the romance and the happiness and the life that they, in my personal opinion, always should have. So please let me know if you guys are interested in that down below. Um, it will be taking over for Monday's uh, build videos um, and builds will then go on Wednesday instead in the random collection of videos like today. Um, but yeah, so that's all I have and thank you guys so much. I would love to hear what you guys think and I'll see you in the next bit. Bye!